Welcome back. We're in the Song of Moses today, and we're going to look at verses 8 to 10. And it's kind of hard to break this song up, into, but we're breaking it up so that we can look at just some, some portions of it with a little bit more detail morning by morning. Let's read these verses. At the blast of your nostrils, the waters were piled up. The flowing waters stood up like a heap. The deeps were congealed in the heart of the sea. The enemy said, I will pursue, I will overtake, I will divide the spoil. My desire shall be gratified against them. I will draw out my sword, my hand will destroy them. You blew with your wind, the sea covered them, they sank like lead in the mighty waters. Okay, so verses eight and nine here, what have we got? The enemy says, I'm gonna do my will, I'm gonna do things my way, I'm gonna crush these people. And in the song, in verse 10, the, the answer is no. No, you're not going to triumph. Not at all. I will prevail. God is prevailing over them. God has a plan. He didn't just bring these people, uh, you know, and we're just starting on the exodus, and God says, oh, oh no, they've been destroyed. That doesn't happen that way. God has a plan. He's going to work his way through. He's going to bring a remnant out of Egypt, and he's going to take them and fulfill his purpose. So, yes, the enemy thinks he's going to prevail. He's coming after them. My, my, my desire will be gratified against them. I am going to crush these Hebrews. No, you're not. And so a lot of times, again, coming to application for us, we're in a situation, we feel like we're ready to be crushed. The enemy's coming on and he's not stopping. You know, crazy stuff is, is imminent and it's against us. But guess what? God is for you. Take heart. God is for you. He was for his people millennia ago in the bringing out of Egypt, and he's for you today as he will bring you and I out of Egypt and into his glorious uh, plan. Okay, we'll say some more tomorrow morning as we continue looking at the Song of Moses. God bless you.